using the MIDI function with your Skoog. Here's my Skoog. There we go. Now if I want to use the MIDI function, I have to select the MIDI panel using the MIDI tab here. Click there, that brings up the MIDI panel, various uh, controls here. There's a MIDI on off button and I can access the general MIDI instruments on the sound card by turning this on and then I can select from the range of MIDI instruments here. Now it's important to note that in order to hear just the MIDI instruments I will need to mute the Skoog Music software here in order to hear just the MIDI. So now, piano. Go. I have my piano and I could uh, select from the whole range of standard MIDI instruments there. We also offer a connect direct to GarageBand and connect direct to Logic buttons. You could also send the in output from Skoog Music and you could send it on a particular channel and pick it up in Cubase or any other program like that. Let's show you what happens here if I say connect to GarageBand. Opens GarageBand, <laughs> connects me directly in there and then I can choose from <laughs> the instrument list there. Now you can still control the Skoog, the Skoog's feature of kind of like sensitivity and the actual notes and things using the Skoog software. So sensitivity is still set here on the main panel. Get it playing. Just right. Same with the polyphonic mode. There we go. And in terms of choosing notes, we still do that using the notes selector action panel. Here we go. Major, minor tuning, transposing, loading in sets of notes, or setting the notes manually. And that's a, a quick introduction as to how to use the MIDI function on your Skoog.